Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Nikki's here. So today is Thursday. So three days has passed since my the first day of my break and I am enjoying every single moment of it. Um, even though I'm relaxing a lot, just watching a lot of TV, but I still get a lot of things done, so that's good. So it is about 10 a.m. I woke up an hour ago. Um, I did some chores, like cleaning the house and everything, and then now I just had my breakfast. As you know, oatmeal is my number one breakfast and lunch and dinner. And I love oatmeal, and it's so good friendly. So I had um, soy milk mixed in with this oatmeal and a little bit of um, peanut butter. Sometimes I just eat it plain without the peanut butter or anything else and it just tastes amazing and it's really comforting to my stomach. Um, last night you saw I had pizza, <laughs> a little naughty naughty. That pizza was not that good though, like it was just too much breading, like the crust was so thick and only like a little bit of cheese on top, so pretty much I was just eating bread. Um, so I had like two pieces, but still it gave me a little bit of a heartburn feeling and I didn't really take anything uh, Except for like this morning. I started to feel a little bit like the burning sensation just a tiny bit So I took one of those um, herbal pill uh, Which one is it? I think it's marshmallow Marshmallow roots. Yeah, so I took that and then it just went away um, But yeah, I'm just watching the Vampire Diaries season 7 so I have two more season I mean including this one and the last season season 8 so I will be finishing this show so good and I won't have to like you know feel bad about like oh I never finished the show that I started like years ago but I am going to um, get a haircut later too and after this um, breakfast I'm gonna go see my neighbor's cat and then Biggest plan for today, I guess I do want to put up my whiteboard in the office. Um, so yeah, I'll show you how that goes. Who did some more shopping? This girl did. What a shame though. I got this short, um, high-waisted short. I kind of knew it wouldn't fit um, because I wear extra small and the smallest was the small. And I kind of knew that it wouldn't fit, but then... I don't know, I've never seen them not offering another extra small, so I thought, okay, maybe this type of jeans, the smallest they make is a, a small and maybe will fit. So I bought it, but no, it's too big, so I'm gonna have to return it. I just printed the return label, um, and then I'm gonna drop it off later. They make it pretty easy to return and exchange, so that's great. Close this window. It's too warm out. Yeah, so I just go into the account. Uh, select the item you wanted to return and then print this pack everything back to the uh, the original packaging and then you're set to drop it off the post office so uh, I don't know I'm not gonna so I decided I mean I did put on a little bit of makeup not really just my put on my brows and a little bit of mascara no foundation nothing I just put on sunscreen of course because I'm going out and then I am going to um, Organize and also I'm just gonna wipe down all of these because they've been sitting here for months um, They're super dusty uh, This is great, but I just want to like actually wipe down everything. So I'm gonna do that now I actually did it Woo. It's all nice and clean now so organized so I put all the palettes and little pots of makeup into those drawers. Let me show you. So these are like my eyeshadows, brow stuff, like all the little pots. And then these are like lips products, miscellaneous stuff here. I actually wiped down like every single bottle because they were so dusty up here for a while. But these are the things that I use on a daily basis, so I keep them out. And then these over here were a little bit unorganized, but again, these are like the things that I use every day, like my um, makeup, like eye makeup shadow, eyeshadow. And then this, this one is almost done. Um, yeah, and then I, I don't know what I want to do with that, so I just throw in a little light, um, like twinkling light. I actually have another one here, but I think it'll be so pretty to turn on at, at nighttime. And I'm gonna turn it off. Maybe I'm gonna throw in some like fake plants or something in here that will look cute too uh, but this is the shelf I think this I'm gonna keep this complete look right here for a while and this will be my makeup table in the morning I come here I usually eat breakfast and then just get access to like do my makeup before I leave I think I will hang that up 
on the wall at some point. Uh, still need to do more work over here. Still quite uh, messy, but here I have adopted Mary Kondo's, you know, tips on getting like boxes to put things in it because you it used to be just like all over the place. So now at least I have this box that I can keep all this junks in, and then over here I have like this little lid from this box to keep the pins and like oh the junk as well but it's looking much better and all the wires and then um when i'm free i want to reorganize so like these are all of my folders from the last semester and i want to keep all of them so i will put them into like separate like folders um this little binder thing not binder like this little uh, folder, yeah. So I'm gonna take everything out from the binders and put them in the folders by the class. Just got back from my haircut. It looks very similar to the last haircut that I had. It just, um, he gave me a little bit more layers here. You can see, like, this layer is shorter. And there's there are more layers in the back. So yeah, I'm happy because I did want to keep the length um, and just wanted more layers, so I got what I asked for. <laughs> um, I'm eating some watermelon and some kale. Kale. I gotta have my vegetable in. People hate kale, but I don't mind it. I actually find it pretty tasty. Especially if you like boil it or like steam it really well and break it down a little bit so it's not as like chewy. Delicious. I used to make like baked kale chips. It takes a lot of time, but if you know how to make it right, it tastes so amazing. Like such a good snack. Alright, I'm gonna go rest a little bit. I'm a little tired. And then I'm gonna come back and do the um, whiteboard installation. Pretty chill day, not as eventful, but at least I got that done. So nice and clean now. Hope are you guys enjoying your day? I know probably all of you are working, um, but hopefully you can catch up over the weekend and do a lot of fun things. Watermelon. It's kind of sad that this is the only fruit that I can eat. Well, I'm not, li I'm not. Well, not really. We can eat almost all melon, like uh, watermelon, um, cantaloupe, honeydew. Like the melon family, even though it's not as healthy as other fruits like oranges, lemon, lime, berries. But those are too a little too sour for good. Um, I eat them once in a while if they like really ripe, like blueberries. I wait for them to be really ripe and sweet, and then I eat them. Okay, so I bought like three of these rolls, and I guess there's no instruction anywhere. It's literally just peel and stick. Oh wait, there's instruction. Use on any surface, multiple uses. Use as a project. This is not. Instruction using a wet cloth to clean includes one pen. No, there isn't. There isn't any pens in here. Where? Lies. Oh, wait. <laughs> there is a pen in here. So. Alright. I'm just gonna open. The roll here. The core. There's a pen in here. Actually, several pens. A black, a green. There's one more. Two more. We have to cut it open. A 
blue and a red as well. So you got how many? Four free pens with this one pack. So you just peel and stick, I guess. Should I clean the wall or something? done there's still a couple of pieces down there and I think I wanted to extend that area a little bit more so I have a pretty long sheets and I'm done